Hello, La Rosa Realtors. We wanted to create today's corporate message to primarily go over our new La Rosa Realty company disclosures. We're not going to have these new disclosures actually circulate beginning October 1st. So these disclosures will be required on all transactions, whether it's working with your buyers, sellers, uh, commercial property, and so on. Uh, if you've seen we've actually what we did in this disclosure, which is now available on Backagent, we've actually combined both the buyer's disclosure and the seller's disclosure into one document. So the language now is actually for both sides of the transaction. Um, the reason why we had these company disclosures is very simple, is to protect you as the agent and also protect the actual company itself. Um, we're going to discuss different items in here such as escrow, HOA, uh, condition of the property, multiple offers and so on. So it's very important that you do have your clients sign this disclosure prior to you actually going into a contract. So we do want to make sure and verify those dates when we're actually reviewing files. So some of the new items that have been added to the actual company disclosure, if we look uh, towards the back on paragraph 15, a lot of agents basically have been um, asking and very curious and, and uncertain on how to actually, if they want to charge their transaction fee to their clients, well, how do they do that? We had agreed upon it in the past that we were going to now allow clients to write it into the actual contract. A lot of agents still didn't feel comfortable with that. So basically, uh, we took a vote and the majority of the agents here at La Rosa Realty were really wanting to have the actual administrative fee back in. So the problem is that with RESPA, we can't have some disclosures that have it and some that do not. So we have to be able to be uniform and have all of our documents have the same exact language. So what we're going to do now is we're going to add it back into the company disclosure. So in paragraph 15, it talks about that we have an administrative fee, which is 295 so this will be charged to either the seller or the actual buyer. Now, if you as an agent do not feel comfortable charging this fee, it's very simple. All you have to do is just put a line through it, you can initial it, uh, and you're good to go. And your transaction fee basically will be taken out of your commission. So that's been paragraph 15. It's been a basically, I would say, re-added or re-put um, back into the actual uh, company disclosure. We've also added two more paragraphs here. Um, paragraph 16, uh, talks about that we do have an affiliated business arrangement with La Rosa Title. It was important for us uh, to be able to have to have this language put back in there. We were trying to go the route of not having it there, but we've been advised that it is required uh, and is best that we do have it. So paragraph 16 talks about that in addition to this company disclosure, you will find an actual affiliated business arrangement disclosure that will discuss basically all of the actual fees, uh, the cost for title insurance, which is set obviously um, there's a formula here for it that will show your clients exactly uh, how that fee is determined uh, and so on. So this affiliated business disclosure uh, will now be added to our company disclosure as basically an exhibit, but it will require your client's signature. Now we've added one more paragraph to our company disclosure, which is paragraph 17. And in regards to total immersion, we're basically still going to be able to waive transaction fees. And now since transaction fees are being charged to the clients, now the actual benefit will go to the consumer, which will allow us uh, per RESPA to be able to actually uh, do this now through total immersion. So paragraph 17 talks about the fact that if you select to use La Rosa Title in a transaction that the clients have the ability to choose our title company, then we will waive the actual fee of 295, which is actually in essence 269, which is your transaction fee. But we've always had the fee built into our contract being 295. So that difference is actually a commission that goes to you. Uh, but in this case here, paragraph 17, um, they would have to select that they would use Larosa Title initial or they would initial that they would not use Larosa Title. Uh, either way, um, they have to have a initial here at paragraph 17 and this will determine whether or not the fees are waived uh, per total immersion. Uh, your clients will be required obviously to sign this and in addition, we're going to have the associates sign and date their uh, company disclosure as well for every transaction. So. Uh, hopefully that kind of explains it somewhat. We're going to do an email as well that will kind of give you kind of uh, more verbiage. Um, and we're also going to be introducing the company disclosures at every office meeting now uh, beginning here in October. So hopefully that answers some questions. If you do have any additional questions about the company disclosure, please feel free to contact our corporate office. Uh, you can speak with anyone here, uh, LV, myself, Iliani. I'll be more than happy to, more than happy to help you out. So. I hope you guys are having a great uh, year so far. We're getting now into our, our final fourth quarter. I can tell you the month of September has been phenomenal. Uh, usually every September is usually a slow month for us, but we actually have a record amount of transactions happening here at La Rosa Realty. So we're very excited about that. Uh, thank you to all the realtors that are out there uh, working very hard. 
Also, do not forget, at the end of this month, we're going to have our La Rosa Olympics on October 25th at, um, I think it's Moss Park. Um, we're going to have a phenomenal uh, all-day barbecue, um, family barbecue, so we want you to bring your family, friends. Um, we're going to have a great day just to kind of be able to network and get to know each other uh, a little more. So I look forward to seeing you guys then, if I don't talk to you uh, before then. And uh, have a great uh, day. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Guided by a beating heart. I can't tell where the journey will end, but I know where to start.